ranked draft event. Let's get it. We already got the tickets from being the uh, legendary Mutt Reward member. And I'm actually going to draft the team and play with them instead of just drafting them and just like quitting and do another draft. Because to be honest, drafting the players is the funnest part of draft champions. Right here, we get Travis Frederick. Okay. And with the new update, offensive linemen kind of make a difference. So I'm going to go ahead and go ahead with Travis Frederick. Next up, we got to take a quarterback. We got to take Matthew Stafford. This might be an elite round, and yes, it is. Now, I played against this RTTP Peters, and he's actually very good. He's a six-foot corner with 92 speed. He has 91 zone. Wow, this card is good. I got I to snatch up. I got to snatch up Marcus Peters. Another goal round, I'm going to go ahead and snatch up to Ron Armstead. Beef up the offensive line. Not too many elites so far. I did pass up on a few to make sure we got some nice positions. But, I mean, we should be getting a lot more elites. And right as I say it, we get another elite player. But this one is a duplicate left tackle. So, we kind of don't need him. This is Jackson. He's kind of slow. So, is Jason Witten. So, I think I'm going to get Dwayne Brown to plug him in at right tackle. Round 7 of 15 is an elite round. And we get down to high tower. We already got a quarterback. So, we do not need Dange Rush Wilson. So, we got to take Dante Hightower because we already have too many tackles. Dante Hightower is the only available option on board. Another elite round, and we get a football outsider. Cecil is short. Okay, I'll take it. Once again, we do not need Sebastian Vaughn because he is a right tackle. So, it's between these two. And I have yet to play with a Robert Quinn card, but I kind of want to play with this Cecil short. <laughs> so, Cecil, it is. Hopefully, we can get some more receivers, some more options. And as soon as I say that, I got to take Martavis. I had to take Martavis immediately. There was no other option on that board. And, ooh, got to take Darby. If you guys have never played with this Ronald Darby, he is a beast. 94 speed, 93 man coverage. I could also take this Ryan Kerrigan and have a pass rusher. But I'd much rather have Ronald Darby. Round 11 to 15 is another elite round. And yes, we get Julius Peppers. They nerfed him though. He only has 79 speed. So I don't know who I want to get. I might snatch up Devin McCourney, put him in strong safety. We already got some linebackers, but I could use Danny Trevathan. He does have 99 pursuit, 84 speed. So he's a very good linebacker. But I'm gonna go ahead and snatch up Devin McCourney, plug him in at strong safety, and we get we got a nice, we got a nice defensive back. Ooh, this is a trash round. Go ahead and take Jerry Hughes, though. We already had some of the other positions, so I'm going to let that live. And, ooh, 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 look at this round. This round is a beast. We got Richard Sherman. We got Antonio Brown. And then we got Devontae Freeman. Ooh, I got to take, I got to take Freeman. We need a running back. We need a running back. I don't actually play with this Freeman, so now we have a running back. We have some nice options on offense. And, ooh. Another elite defensive round. We gotta take Fletcher Cox. We got to. We already got two safeties. We could use a defensive tackle. He has 82 speed. He only has 82 blocks yet. But now that I'm looking at it, he's kind of comparable to Fletcher Cox. He's, he's a little bit faster to have a similar block shed. It's just he has 92 power move and then Fletcher Cox has 88. So actually, I'm gonna scoop up this Tyrone Crawford. See how he plays, might pick him up in Mutt. And our last round is gonna be, ooh, we got Walter Payton. We don't really need him, no. We got Devontae Freeman. We already got some wide receivers. I might be able to take Sterling Sharp or I could just I could just get Walter and put one of them at wide receiver. I could always take Shannon Sharp, but he's a boring legend, so I'm gonna go ahead and snatch up Walter Payton. He, I think he's gonna make the biggest difference out of all three of these legends. Let's check out what the team is looking like. Here is what the team is looking like. They already popped in Devontae Freeman at wide receiver number three. So we're gonna get some slot action out of him. I might swap him and uh, Walter Payton throughout the game. So we, can, so we can see both of them in action out of the backfield, you know, running some crisp routes, whatever you wanna call it. And then they've already plugged in Teron Armstead at right tackle. So we already got that figured out. And on the defense, they've already plugged in my two safeties. I'm gonna have to use her down to Hightower at right outside linebacker. And then we got the two corners. Well, that is the video, folks. A very quick draft, champions draft. I'm gonna play with this team, I promise you. I promise you, I will play with this team. Barring any, you know, disconnects or lag out or boots or anything. As long as none of that happens, I will play with this team. But this is your boy Vic. Drop a like if you enjoyed and subscribe if you're new. Mm, but I'm out.